In my last video, my guest Shanna claimed that the reason that she was already over 0.08 after one buzz ball was because she had Listerine. You're not a lightweight. 0.103. Were you drinking already? No. But she had been drinking. Wait, oh. What? Did you drink already? No, I used Listerine. I mean, that was how long ago? I can't believe that it's taken me this long to actually test this out. I have heard before that certain mouthwashes do register on a breathalyzer. I don't know why, I just never tried it out. We're gonna see if Shanna's claim that she was well over a 0.08 was due to her mouthwash. So I'm gonna use some mouthwash and then I'm gonna see how long it registers for as far as the breathalyzer goes. Let's get after it. So in the video, Shanna said Listerine specifically. I went and I bought some Listerine for a fresher, cleaner mouth than brushing alone. Kills 99.9% .9 of germs that cause bad breath, plaque, and gingivitis. Does it say anything about alcohol? It says peel here. Water, 21.6% alcohol. It says flavor. That's an ingredient. It literally just says flavor. Let's open this thing. So I'm going to swish it around. And I'm gonna time myself for a minute. And then I'm gonna breathalyze right away and see what it does, if it's even gonna register. I have a feeling it's gonna be like the pickles and it's barely gonna register. I'm gonna to have to basically drink this thing for it to register and that sounds weird. I'm not drinking this stuff, I'm spitting it out into a cup. I'll breathalyze right away and then maybe I'll breathalyze every five minutes or something like that. So say I was at home getting ready and I'm going to a party and I'm brushing my teeth and I use some mouthwash and I leave and I get pulled over, where am I at? If I have to guess, maybe a .01. Error? Max BAC exceeded? What? It, it aired it out? What? So I'm gonna give it three minutes and see where it's at. And then we'll do five minutes. I did not think it was gonna be that high. So it's possible Shanna did just do some Listerine maybe? It's been three minutes, let's see. Oh, it's making me count down from 10 this time because it aired out. 0.019. Been a total of eight minutes, let's see where we're at. Zeros. So obviously, Shanna was not still registering after gargling some Listerine. I did happen to stop at the store and pick up some other mouthwashes to see if it makes any difference. We're gonna try a couple of them out and see how long it takes each one. We got Scope, it's the original mint. The other one was Cool Mint. 8% alcohol, so this is just the little guy. All right, let's do the same thing with the Scope. Let's see how this goes. Okay, I don't recommend that part. Spraying all over the place. 0.256. So the scope didn't error it out. So let's give it three minutes and then we're gonna see if it's still registering. Well, this one's counting down from 10 too. 0.021. Let's give it five minutes and see if we're still on the map. All right, so we're at zeros. I think we've established by the time you use your mouthwash, get into your car and start driving, you're not gonna register. Unless you're doing mouthwash right before the cop pulls you over, I don't think you have anything to be concerned about. I got one more. This one says that it's alcohol free. So I'm curious if I use this one and breathalyze immediately after, it says alcohol free. It should register zeros, right? So we're gonna try this out and see if that still registers zero or is it like an implied like, well, you know, there's not a lot of alcohol, so we're gonna put no alcohol. I'll try not to make a mess this time. This should register zeros. Zeros. So it's not false advertising. I think that we've established that these two, you'll register for like a hot minute. This one, you will not at all. What I do know is I have minty fresh breath right now. Thanks for doing science with me today. Make sure that you smash that subscribe button and I'll see you next time. Cheers.